Hello, in this video I will show how you can split an ebook file. So let's do it. Well, now I'm showing my screen and the first thing you have to do is to go on Google and search for Calibri. Um, click here in this link I will put uh, in the description of this video, calibrebook.com and you need to download this application. You can click here to download Calibre, select your uh, operational system, in my case it's window, and then you have to click here, uh, download Calibre, uh, for example, 64-bit. I have already downloaded it, so I will not do this. And then you have to follow the step-by-step -step process. It's very simple to uh, have the app in your computer so after doing that you open the app Calibre ca sorry Calibre and here you you click on this option to add books click here and then you find your file in my case I will search um, I will search here it's the book Principles, Principles for Dealing with the Changing Order by Ray Dalio. And then you add it here. And now, uh, what you have to do is to go, in, go on Preferences. Then you search for Plugins. Click here. And here below, you click on Get New Plugins. And in filter by name, you will search by uh, split. Um, sorry, epub, epub is. Oh my God! What is the name? Ah, okay. Uh, I have already installed it, so I will change this filter here. I think it, you yeah only uh, search by split, and then you will see this epub split plugin here. And you will have to click here uh, on install and then uh, click in the button to, um, to install it. Like, for example, it will open this box here and then you just click yes, okay. And then you will have to restart the Calibre app. And after uh, restarting it, you will see uh, this icon here above a pub split and then you go and click select the book you want to split and click here to split you will see that uh, it it's gonna generate an error here for example let me do it you will see this plugin only works on a pub to format ebooks and this error uh, may also occur for you. What you have to do and what worked for me is to click with the right uh, button of your mouse uh, above uh, selecting your book and then you go here to um, convert, convert books and you click on convert individually. Then here uh, you can see that my ebook is already in a pub, but I received the error that it, it must be in a pub to format. What I did is to uh, change the output format here to a pub again. Okay, it's, it's strange because I'm converting from a pub to a pub, but it worked. You can also uh, for example, if your file is a mob file, you can convert from mob to a pub. And I think it's also gonna work. Or if it is, um, for example, a PDF or other kind of file. But I believe your ebook will be uh, an EPUB file. But then you can convert a pub to a pub. Um, Click here on OK and wait. It's gonna take uh, uh, some time to, to finish the conversion. Let's wait. OK, it converted. I didn't change the name, so it's the same name. 
principles for for dealing with the changing world order i think it's the same cha the same name i'm not sure now but whatever now you need to select it again and then uh, let me select it and then go here on on a, a pub split click here it's gonna open this tab and if you want to split the for example in two parts this a book you can go here in configure and then new book per and you will see some options here uh you can you can split it uh by section or per number of sections but i think the best option here for you uh is any new books uh you can like divide as you can see here uh, the sections evenly and i i selected two here uh, uh, sorry i inserted two the number of books that i want and click on okay and now i will uh, select this first section here and click on control press control and then a to like select all the sections you know press and hold control and then click on a um uh, and then now you can click here in n n new books and you will uh divide the entire book in two new books uh this doesn't matter you can uh, actually here you, you can just click on yes and then it started splitting the a book uh, I will just click here yes again because I think this is 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 because this a book is lacking some information but this is not a fact um, you just need to click on yes um, defaulted metadata fill it in okay yes again now you can see that two new books uh, were created I will click down here and here we have uh, the two new books first it created the cover which is the part one the first part I will even rename it part one um, Ray Dalio Ray Dalio and then I will rename here to part two and now you can go on the folder that you choose it when uh, you install the the app to store your ebooks but if you don't remember it you can just click with the right button above the the ebook here the divided ebook here and you can click on open book folder here then you will see that here we have the epub file which is the part one and you can uh, go back one section here and you will see that we have two folders part one and part two and here we have the epub file for part two so you can just uh, for example if you want to send it to your kindle send uh, through gmail you can just uh move this to your G gmail uh, or move is not the right word you can just attach this file to uh your email you know and send it as um as the as the ebook you know you can send first part one and then part part two because gmail has a limit of size you can only uh, send files that um, have up to 25 megabytes so in this this ebook here principles for um, principles for dealing with the changing world order has 30 34 megabytes the size as you can see here so we have the divided it into part one which has uh, 14 megabytes 
and part two, 22. Now we can send first the part one file and then the part two file to our Kindle uh, using Gmail, you know, because each file size is, uh, is below the limit, is below 25. So, um, I think this uh, the video is it. You have the file here and you just have to send it or do whatever you want, okay? So, if this video was helpful for you, subscribe to this channel and click on the like button. Um, yeah, thank you for watching.